I'm here with softball coach Bill Triplett after a couple of wins over Minnesota Crookston. Coach, it was the home opener today. What was kind of the mindset of the team heading into the game, just kind of get into the flow and actually have a home game today? Well, we kind of treat it as must wins. You know, we dropped four on the road last weekend. We had an extra inning affair with Wayne State, a 9-8 to eight game with Augie, and, and uh, we were 1-4 coming in, and we figured it was two must wins, try to get to 3-4, and four and pick up some more W's, you know, you got to get the top 10 teams in the league to get to the tournament. We got to take care of our home field. We thought, you know, if we could just win all our home games and sneak a few out on the road, we might be okay, but it was a must win for us. Do you feel like you can build off today's success going into the weekend? You have Sioux Falls on Friday. Well, yeah, and they're, but they're a very good team. They've been winning a lot of games this year and, and uh, you know, we've lost a couple starters to broken fingers and broken hands. You know, we lost our catcher, Sarah Nix against Augie, and, and uh, we lost our third baseman, Allie Glant. She plays third when Cornejo pitches. But like I told the, the tip players, sometimes other people step up when you lose people like that. And Hill did a good job at third, and she's had to play some outfield now because Bell's had to catch with losing Nick. So moving kids around, but it's, it's good to get the wins and get those people to get their feet wet in other spots. So, so I think going into the weekend, we'll be more comfortable playing those kids out of position because of today.